have beautiful South American rattlesnake. And this snake is one of the nicest people I know. This is one of the top sweetest snakes that I've known in 45 years of handling venoms. This snake has always been so sweet. Now, just by the way, um, for people who dislike snakes and venomous snakes, dislike all you want, but bear in mind that their venom is used to make anesthesia. So if you've had surgery, you owe them. Hmm? Your best friend's a dog, you might think that, but their venom also takes care of hypertension, it takes away migraines, cures a common cold. Oh, and by the way, it cures cancer. It does. Don't believe me, look it up. Of course, Big Pharma won't want you to know that. So whenever these things are proven, the companies that work with the venom, suddenly they get very, very quiet and stop talking to people. And suddenly they have like Ferraris and stuff. So the days of chemotherapy and radiation may not be coming to an end real, anytime real soon. But it's interesting. There was this scumbag guy, some doctor who gave 100 patients chemotherapy who didn't need it. Right? They were healthy just for the money. They get paid, you know. So 80 died. Think about that. Out of 100 healthy patients, 80 died. Well, what if they did have cancer? Now you're in your most weakened state, and now you're getting this insane concoction of toxicities put inside of you, and then they radiate you. Come on, you know, get real. How could that? I, I, I just can't take it seriously. Look up snake venom and cancer. You know, just look it up. Tell people. You know, tell people what you find. Don't believe me, that would be stupid. Look it up. You'll be amazed. It doesn't just have promise, it works. It's like targeted therapy. They, they shoot it at the tumor, the tumor stops growing, period, done. Cancer's cured. Don't believe me, look it up. Say thank you to him, say thank you. Mwak. True, seriously, look it up, in all seriousness. Thank you.